If I were going to be on Google Plus and create a circle, these guys would be invited. Oh. Really? Oh. You guys would be in my circle. Oh, I'm blushing now, and I don't blush. <laughs> Usually it's my head that blushes. What do you, what do you got going well, on? I was just looking at page 64 of our new cookbook, Cedar Plank steaks. Okay. Uh -huh, and yes. 107 is Cedar Plank Salmon. Mm. And yesterday we were at Cedar Creek in Appleton at the intersection of 00 and 441. And we did some Cedar Plank cooking for them. Okay. Yeah, and we great. had 50 plus people coming up asking us about Cedar Plank cooking. They've never did it before. They wanted to try it. And here's a couple ways you can do it. Okay. This is actually a, a big slab of oak that my brother-in-law Gary uses as wood for the winter. Okay. It's untreated. He could soak this in water for a couple hours, submerge it, and he could slap a big old beef tenderloin on there, mm -hmm. season it up, place it on the grill with a nice fire underneath, put the hood down, and about 50 minutes later, this would be charred and that tenderloin would be smoked. Okay. But today, Merrill, could you have me my, my cherry? Exhibit A, here's your cherry, From sir. Cedar Creek, we have a little bit of cherry, and all you have to do is soak the cedar or the cherry wood, rather, yep. for a couple of hours so it's nice and moist. And I'm going to do a couple. Look at these porter houses of, Those are of beautiful. pork chop. Yeah, Isn't that gorgeous? Nice. Those and, are beautiful. And I'm just going to simply add a little bit of great oil over the top of those, season those up really nice with a little bit of our grilling magic, which is a garlic pepper blend. Mm. I'm going to do it in the cavity because I made a cavity last night so that I could stuff these with dried cherries to go with our cherry board oh, and, and feta you're cheese. You're going to do your cavity cheese? of filling, aren't feta, you? Feta <laughs> cheese and dried cherries. <laughs> and we're going to stuff those inside of there. Oh. I'm going to put that on the cedar planks. I'm going to try to make room, but I don't think I'm going to do it with these nice big pork chops. I'm going to try to make room, but I'm going to put these then off to the side, which are sweet potatoes, off to the side. Ooh. In the next segment, I'm going to do a finishing sauce with the cherry syrup and our hickory barbecue sauce. Wow, that looks like it's going to be phenomenal. Where'd you get those at? Uh, I said Cedar Creek. Oh, they, okay. But I'll tell you what, nice medium direct heat with the hood down probably for at least 30 minutes. Okay, No gotcha. peaking, no peaking. No, Very no nice. peaking, no duck either. Are we, do we, are we talking about Well, you know what we are, we're going to talk about a little cheese. You know, Sandy Peterson in New London couldn't believe that I smoked the cheese yesterday. <laughs> and we went out and we did. We smoked the cheese. You take string cheese, just exactly what he was talking about on the uh, on the cherry board there. I had actually did mine in, in uh on cedar. Yep. And it's very simple what I've done here. Can you right group that, oh, sir? Oh, this is so cool. All right, now you actually, you can even place that right in the border Ooh. wherever you want there. What we're going to do, as you can see, that we put this on the cedar plank, it will get the smoke flavor, even yep. if you had hickory and everything. This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to put this in the refrigerator mm -hmm. for about, yeah, maybe 30, 40 minutes. It'll firm right up, and we'll just uh, serve it later, but you'll be able to taste the smoke on the cheese and everything else. That it's just is regular string cheese. Fantastic, you guys. Yeah, we're going to have just, a great just, meal just, this oh, morning. Oh, we are. We are. I'm hungry. I'm good. I'm hungry. <laughs> Take a look at your screen. Uh, that'll tell you when you can watch Mad Dog and Merrill Midwest Grilling on the CW14 after Good Day Wisconsin at 9.30. We'll be right back.